guys. I hope you're doing well. I hope you had an awesome week. And I hope some of you, now that we're several days into to December, I hope some of you guys have gotten to put some Christmas decorations up, got to put your trees up, decorate those. I know that's always a ton of fun. And I actually, Jenna and I, just a couple days ago, um, several days ago, put up our, our Christmas tree, got it all decorated and, and put some lights up. Um, really, she did most of the work, but it looks really it looks really awesome. But hopefully, you guys have gotten to do some of that. And as you can tell here, I've got one of those things here with me today. So I wanted to use this Christmas ornament, kind of like a disco ball, and put it in the sunlight. It looks especially like a disco ball. But I wanted to use this Christmas ornament to talk about something today. Now, some of you guys maybe have already put your tree up and put your ornaments on and maybe some of you guys haven't yet or maybe some of you don't but I'd venture to say a lot of us probably at least at some point during Christmas time or in December put some of these ornaments on a tree. Now what do you guys what do you guys think about this ornament? Does this ornament mean anything to you? Probably not right? It's silver, it's pretty, kind of looks like a disco ball but it probably doesn't really mean much to you right? And we probably all have some ornaments like this that we have on our tree. I know Jenna and I put some ornaments that, that were kind of like this, that uh, were pretty and looked nice, but didn't really mean anything, right? But if you guys are anything like me, and I think a lot of you probably are, a lot of our favorite ornaments to put on a tree, we choose to put on a tree for a specific reason. And I might look at some of the ornaments on your, your guys' tree and think that they might not mean anything to, to, to me. And you guys might look at some of the ornaments I have on my tree and they might mean nothing to you. You might even think they look kind of weird. But each of us, I mean, all of our families, I think, for the most part, I'm sure, have specific ornaments that we choose to put on our tree, that we choose to place there for a specific reason. Like me, I have ornaments that we put on our tree that maybe, I have some ornaments that I picked out when I was, when I was your guys' age, when I was a little kid, that I really liked and just thought were fun, and my parents have given to me now that we're old enough to have our own tree, they've given us those ornaments that I picked out when I was a kid. So I put that's why I put those on our tree because they have that kind of special memory. I have some ornaments that I've got that are really special to me that I got from from family members that they gave they gave to me as as a gift that I really like, and that's why I put those on our tree. I've got some that <clears throat> I've got some that family members have even made for me that they created themselves. Or I've got some that were given to Jenna and I as a gift when we first got married, as our first Christmas together kind of ornament. And that's why, that's the reason I put that on our tree. And I think a lot of our families are probably that same way. We all have special reasons for certain ornaments that we really love, and that's why we choose to put those on our tree. And they mean something to us. You see, we're a lot like those, those special ornaments. Because God has a reason that he's placed each one of us here on earth, right? We might we may look at somebody else's tree and not understand the reason why we put something that you know some uh, an ornament like that on the tree. We don't understand the reason. But to each person, they have a special reason. Just like God has a special reason, He's placed each one of us on earth. He's chosen to put us here for a reason. He's got something for us that He wants us to do. He's got a plan for us, and He's chose to put us right where we're at for a specific reason. And that's really pretty cool, right? The same God that created everything we see, this whole entire world, has chosen us, each of us, and placed us on earth for a special reason, and he has a plan for us. So my encouragement and my challenge to you guys, if you haven't already decorated your tree, is, or if you have, to go back and look at your ornaments, and some of the ornaments that are special to you, that you have a certain reason why you like that ornament, and why you put it on the tree. So when you put those ornaments on your tree, is to think about, the reasons why that God has put you here on this earth. Because each of us, he's given us a reason why he's chosen to place us on the earth. And that's pretty cool, right? All right, I'm gonna pray and we'll call it a day. God, I thank you so much for today. God, I thank you for, for Christmas time, for a time to remember that you gave us the greatest gift of all, your son Jesus. God, I just pray that this uh, Christmas time, you'd help us to remember that each and every one of us was, was chosen by you for a specific reason to be here. God, that you, you've given each of us a reason to be on this earth and that you have a special plan for each of us. Help us to always remember that, Lord. We love you and pray all these things in Jesus' name. Amen. See you guys.